Fae, pronounced Fae is an action-adventure video game developed by Zoink and published by Electronic Arts under its EA Originals program. It was released on February 16, 2018 for Microsoft Windows, Nintendo Switch, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. In it, the player controls Fae, a fox-like creature in a forest setting, attempting to defend it from hostile entities called the Silent Ones, gaining help from other forest creatures by guiding them to complete tasks and learning new abilities from those it helps. Fae is the first game in the EA Originals series, which is EA's program created to promote indie developers. Gameplay Fae is an action-adventure game in which the player controls Fae, a fox-like creature within a forest that is highly responsive to the songs of the creatures and plants within it. The forest creatures are being attacked by entities called the Silent Ones for unknown reasons that threaten the forest's wildlife. Fae is able to sing to other creatures and objects to gain their help. These creatures can teach Fae a new song which gives the fox additional abilities through the forest, such as activating a flower that acts as a jump pad to launch Fae to higher locations and explore more of the world. The game has been noted to have minimal instructions, requiring the player to experiment and to perceive the forest's ecosystem to determine how to progress, instead of a set of objectives. One example requires the player to observe that one species of bird likes a certain type of flower, suggesting that they may be able to use the bird's song to interact in a different manner than if they used the flower's song. Fay has been favorably compared to Journey and Shadow of the Colossus for this hands-off approach to gameplay. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Development Fay, named after the Swedish language term for fairy, was developed by the Swedish-based studio Zoink. The studio's chief executive officer, Klaus Lindjeld, called the title, a personal narrative about our relationship with nature, and to emphasize that, everything in this world is connected. Most of the team grew up near forests and frequently played within them, getting close to the wildlife there, while overcoming fears of the deeper forests being scary places. Creative director Hugo Bile said they wanted to stay true to the recollection of their Nordic forests, populated by creatures with no spoken language. Bile said games like Journey and Shadow of the Colossus were inspiration, and that they always wanted to capture the exploration mechanics of games in the Metroid and Zelda series. Fay was first announced during the EA Play event occurring alongside the Electronic Entertainment Expo 2016 in June of that year. It was presented as the first of EA Originals. A new segment of EA's publishing aimed to help indie developers with financing and publishing of their titles to reach a wider audience without EA being as involved in the game's development, thus allowing the studio to take more of a share of sales revenues. The game was later featured in a playable demo form at the 2017 Gamescom Exposition in August 2017, along with the target release of 16 February 2018 for Microsoft Windows, Nintendo Switch, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One. Reception Faye received «mixed or average» reviews, according to video game review aggregator Metacritic. <laughs> Notes <laughs>